news everywhere. Restrictions have been very confusing. The new public health orders which will come into effect on Tuesday are targeting those who are unvaccinated in Manitoba, but some say this is the wrong approach. On Friday, Dr. Brent Rusin announced new health orders to try and convince the unvaccinated to get the shot. Unvaccinated individuals in Manitoba will now have limitations on private indoor and outdoor gatherings. Martin Harder, the mayor of Winkler, says these restrictions are just creating more division. Quit jerking everybody around and having different rules for different places you go into. That simply isn't working. The arm of Winkler currently has 41.5% vaccination rate, making it the second lowest uptake in Manitoba. The arm of Stanley, far lower at 24.2%. Harder says the only way for those who are unvaccinated and don't want the vaccine to actually get the vaccine is to experience the effects of COVID-19. Personally, I had a daughter in Texas who has had the Delta variant. I know what she went through and I would never ever wish that for anybody, not my enemy nor my friends or my family. Morden Mayor Brandon Burley taking his frustrations to social media saying if the unvaccinated just got vaccinated there would be no issue. He writes, nothing could be more detached from reality than expecting unvaxxed in this region to adhere to the new public restrictions on their own. Until the province sends help on enforcement, restrictions will make no difference. Manitoba is moving to code orange Tuesday as the fourth wave continues. Cases are slowly starting to creep up in the province with a test positivity rate sitting at 3%. Virologist Dr. Jason Kindrachuk doesn't expect a drastic change in vaccination uptake. It's going to take a long time to, to try and build that trust. There's there's a lot of questions that, that are being raised and, uh, you know, w whether we feel that they are, um, you know, they're, they're based on any sort of, you know, scientific merit or any sort of validity. Um, we still have to try and, and be able to have those, those cogent conversations to, to discuss those. With many still unvaccinated, the lingering question, just how bad will the fourth wave be? Unvaccinated people are the ones that are, are you know, predominantly showing up uh, in ICUs and in hospitals and those that are not fully vaccinated. Um, we need to get people vaccinated to uh, to, to try and uh, you know offset that as much as we can. I'm very, very concerned about the COVID and the impact it has, but I'm even more concerned about the lasting impact both on communities, on families, and on churches because of the divide that is being created. In Winnipeg, Alex Carpa City News.